Uh, Steven, go a bit more minus because it's sensitive. Steven, I think you are the rocker man of participation here. I'm what? The rocker man of participation in Volta Catalonia. Yeah, you did yeah. twelve. You did twelve times consecutive. Twelve times already. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I keep on going. So uh, no, I like this race and uh, it's good to to be here and uh, it's always for a climber and uh, as me, it's a nice race to do here. Yeah. Is it a better race than all the others that you come so much? <laughs> uh, no, it's always fitting in my program well and I think my quality suit this race so uh, I'm looking forward to it uh, to be here again. And do you have the impression that the race got even harder this year? When you look at the profile overall, it maybe yeah, it's more it's, uh, look like there's one more stage extra who is uh, going to be really difficult, uh, the stage on Saturday. This looks like a, like a hard one uh, we have never done before so uh, I'm curious how it will be. What is the plan with the team now? Uh, we have, uh, of course, Sepp, who uh, is really good shape, and uh, I think he, uh, this this route uh, suits him well, and uh, as well for Kian, I think we have uh, two opportunities to do well in the GC. And just to conclude, uh, what about today? The, change is, the stage is a bit different than before. What will it be? Can we see already attack of the GC leaders? Will it be just even if I'm more uh, chaotic in the final with that last climb? Uh, for sure, will be chaotic, always like in this uh, first stages. But uh, no, we have to see. Uh, I think the GC rise more, tend more to be uh, saving it for tomorrow and the day after. But uh, yeah, you, it's gonna be still hot, uh, hot for today. Uh, so we have to see how it works out. But uh, yeah, we have to be in front to to keep our guys there. Okay, Stephen. Good luck. Success. Cheers.